So I'm talking here to Jose from uh, the NASA Human Adventure Exhibition. NASA, what is what is that, Jose? What kind of exhibition is that? Well, uh, this is a quite a unique exhibition that uh, we tell a story here about a human adventure that was the uh, space exploration. We have uh, around uh, over 300 uh, original objects and over 150 objects that are flown in, into space, and we tell a story about exploration. Mm -hmm. It's opening when? It's opening June 13. And it will stay until? It would stay until January. Yeah. And we are here at the Jaarbeurs in the Beatrixgebouw, and you have picked some unique objects. Let me take a look at the, a couple of them. What, is, uh, what do I see here? Here you see, I call it one of the first computers. This is Von Braun's slide rule. That the original Von Braun? The original, I'm sure he had more, but this was used by him on his, uh, it was still used after the computer, still used his slide rule. Okay, and then we have here for the computer guys, we have here an original memory of about 10K. Exactly, 16K to be more precise of a memory circuit. I, the teenagers love this because I, I tell them, imagine the size of a mobile phone. If you need to use this memory circuit, your mobile phone would be the size of a car. Indeed, and here we have some original material from which uh, flights are these? Well, uh, this was, uh, we call it this case, which is the uh, display systems, and it uh, allows already an enormous of 64,000 characters, uh, and this was used for the uh, Apollo missions, for the Apollo command model. And here we see a fantastic real computer. What, what year is this? Uh, this, as I was told, was initialized in uh, uh, 1978. Uh, was used first up into 19 uh, in the 80s, and it was used up until 1992 for the space shuttle uh, payload uh, bay. And what do I have here? What kind of material is this? Well, this is a special ceramic to withstand temperatures as hot as the sun. This is the tile that protects the space shuttle on reentry, and this is a piece of foam uh, right here of the uh, space shuttle uh, main uh, uh, fuel. And here we're seeing a proud invention of NASA. What, uh, why should I be happy with this? Well, uh, you and all the mothers of this world should be happy because disposable diapers were made because of NASA and space exploration. Here's an example of it. And what is this? Well, this uh, mechanism is the uh, mechanism that opens the hatch door. It was done after the Apollo 1 accident. Uh, which had White Roger Chaffee and Gus Grisman died, and uh, uh, they could not open the door from the inside. So they, the engineers built this uh, to open the hatch in less than one minute from the inside. So these are all original, these are all original stuff. Here we see a, a, a boot. This, we see a moon boot, and we see a moon glove, and yes, these are all originals. And a moon case where to store the uh, moon rocks the astronauts used. And here we see some examples of food, my favorite one being the vodka from the cosmonauts. Didn't happen with the Americans, Sam? Eh? Nope, no alcohol in the American mission. And of course, then we have some examples of the, uh, this little can here of the space shuttle uh, food, Apollo mission, and another cosmonaut uh, 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 type of uh, uh, tube with food. And lastly, we have here a nice plastic bag. A, a nice plastic bag uh, from the early 60s that was given by Yuri Gagarin and is signed by him inside. And it's in plastic because plastic at the time was the biggest invention, was the high tech of materials. But I, I saw in a tour of the facility, you have all the big things too, right? Oh, absolutely. We have the uh, Mercury, Gemini, and Apollo spacecrafts. We have uh, the uh, Gina Tarking Dock. We have a Sputnik uh, satellite, and we have spacesuits. I think that the best thing is just come over and see it. Yeah. And I also saw uh, uh, rockets in all kinds, and rocket engines, and uh, and the Apollo 13, and and a lot, and even even also. Uh, uh, you know, things to, to float in the, on the sea? Absolutely. We have original flotation rings uh, that were actually used on the sea. Uh, we have uh, the Apollo command model. Uh, we, we really have some. In, we were very lucky to get these incredible pieces unique uh, in Europe. Yeah, and this is the third stop or the fourth stop? Oh, well, this is now the uh, fourth stop. We were in Stockholm, Madrid, Istanbul, and now Utrecht, and after this will be Tokyo. So we won't be coming back to Europe in, a few, in the next few years. Thank you very much, Roger. You're welcome.